I'm Keith Peters with the Palo Alto Weekly. I'm John Michael Hansen. I'm a junior and I play tennis for Sacred Heart Prep. I'm John Parsons. I'm a junior on the Sacred Heart Prep tennis team. Last week, uh, John Michael and John Parsons uh, played in three tennis matches, uh, number one doubles team for Sacred Heart Prep. They won all three matches in uh, the NorCal tennis tournament. Uh, Sacred Heart Prep won the championship, and for that performance, uh, John Michael and John Parsons are uh, the Palo Alto Weekly Co-Boys Athletes of the Week. Uh, congratulations. Last week in the NorCal tournament, uh, Saratoga, which uh, did not play in a tournament, that was the team you beat in the CCS finals, did that lessen the intensity in the tournament at all? Um, it may have lowered uh, some of the competition. Obviously, Saratoga is a great team, and it's always harder when they're around. But there were still great teams there, and as far as the intensity of our team goes, we were just maxed out. The, um, did you have a favorite tournament? Was the CCS tournament uh, more exciting or, how about, or NorCal? Uh, I think both tournaments were equally exciting. I think our intensity level was equally as high for both matches, uh, both tournaments, and, uh, and CCS and, both, and NorCal's both have significant meaning. The, uh, you guys played uh, number one doubles most of the season. Uh, what makes a good doubles team? Well, before playing one doubles this season, we've been playing doubles together since the sixth grade, and really that kind of experience, and also we've had the same coach teaching us to play doubles, so really knowing what the other person's going to do at all times and understanding their game is huge. The, uh, during the season, uh, you played uh, not only number one doubles, but you played singles, you got switched, you got uh, paired with different players. How did you stay sharp? for the uh, postseason when you were playing with other people during the season? Yeah, I mean, during the season we got switched around. We were experimenting with different teams, but uh, always at practice, Jam and I would play doubles together. Um, we, pra we practiced together singles and doubles. So we know each other's games really well, as he said, since sixth grade. So it wasn't that hard of a transition. Obviously, uh, tennis players uh, don't stop during the summer. What are you going to be doing during the summer? Um, well, I have six tournaments in the first five weeks of my summer, starting in June. And then I'm going to take a break for a little bit in July, and then I'm going to be back into it in August and play probably five or six more tournaments. Next season, uh, you're going to be a senior, and uh, are you going to be playing singles or are you going to be playing doubles? Uh, next season, Jam and I uh, will probably be playing singles. Uh, probably we'll have to break up this doubles team. Um, but I'm sure we'll still be playing doubles in practice and outside tournaments. Um, but, and so, yeah. John Michael, what was uh, the highlight for you this season? Uh, the highlight was Jamie Hutter clinching the CCS final against Saratoga. It was really nice to see our entire team come together at the end of the year like that and win, just take it this year when we couldn't last year. John, how about you? Uh, I'd say same, but I'd say the overall season um, was, a, was a complete high. I think that that culminated, uh, the, the Jamie Hutter's clinching the match was culminated into our entire season. Um, so I'd say our entire season was just a general high. Well, Sacred Heart Prep boys uh, tennis team finished the season 27 and three. They won CCS title. They won NorCal championship. Congratulations to both you guys. Thank you. Thanks. Appreciate it.